What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Casper's Kicks, as always. As always, welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you for tuning in. So today is April 17th. Yes, y'all do know what today is. Today was the release date for the Hyper Royals. If you hit on sneakers, congratulations. Good job to y'all for that hit. I did not hit, so for those that didn't hit, let's just take a quick moment of silence. Yeah, the, the sneakers release I did not hit on. Look, I, I will show y'all what I saw this morning. This is this is what I saw this morning on sneakers. I just, I have no luck with draws on sneakers. I don't think I've ever hit on a draw on sneakers before on my account. And I've had my account since like probably 2018, I want to say. So it's been a long time. Never hit on a draw. We don't get sneaker passes where I am just because there's no Nike store here. We only have Nike factory stores and they never get the sneaker passes. So, you know, it is what it is. No luck on the draw this morning at all. Like I said earlier, for those that did hit on sneakers on the draw, props to you. Let me know in the comments what y'all do to hit on these draws or get sneaker passes or get exclusive access. I never get any of those at all. I think my mom has hit on a draw before, you know, just, and I, I'm always on my account. I'm always liking, I know I've, I've heard people say, you know, the best way to hit on your sneakers account is to go in and like the videos or like shoes that you want to buy, hit the notify me button, uh, watch the little clips that they have on there. I've done all that. Still nothing. I, I've never, I haven't gotten exclusive access in over a year. Like, as you see here, I didn't hit on the draw this morning. So, you know, it is what it is. For those that hit, like I said, good to good to y'all. Glad y'all ready to get y'all, get your shoe, get your size, hopefully. Or if you reselling the shoe, hopefully you got what you needed to get, make a little money off of the shoe. The hype is crazy for these. We already knew how it was going to be. This is just like the University Blue Ones. This is like the Mochas. We already knew the hype for the Hyper Royals was going to be crazy. And that's exactly what we're seeing right now, especially with the delayed shipments with other stores not having pairs. So that's what I want to get into now. Is there still hope to get pairs for retail? Do you need to pay resale right now? Yes and no. So we know the stores that released today were sneakers had them on their app. I know Shoe Palace had in-store a uh, release for their pairs. I know they did a raffle this week for their pairs. Uh, a couple of probably mom and pop shops released pairs as well. Uh, if you don't know what mom and pop shops are, they're the little small stores that aren't like franchises around the country. So those stores might've had pairs as well, but the big brand name stores, I know Shoe Palace was the big one that had men's and grade school sizes. So for foot sites, if you don't know what foot sites are, foot sites are foot action, champs, foot locker, kids foot locker, all that is under just the name of foot sites. They did not release their men's pairs and I don't think they released their grade school pairs either. So I know the men's pairs were delayed for them. Also JD and finish line didn't release their stores in store, their pairs in store either. So we know all of those, all those sites or all those stores do app raffles for, especially for foot sites. I know JD and Finish Line, they kind of go back and forth with if they do an in-store raffle or if they do a app raffle. So yes, there is still hope to get pairs for retail. You know, if you don't want to pay resale and just kind of want to wait, that's perfectly okay. There are still going to be plenty of pairs to come. We know Foot Locker is going to get a bunch of pairs. They always have a bunch of pairs of these. So the key with that is Flex App, of course. Now, I don't have good luck with Flex App. I never have. I never hit on Flex App before. I know it's all about, they're going to they tell you it's not about the points, but it's about how many points you have and how much money you spent with the foot sites at their stores. So if you have a ton of points on Flex, you'll be good. Just like if you've hit on Flex before, like on the University Blue Ones and you hit on Flex, more than likely you have a great chance of hitting on the Hyper Rose on the Flex app. If you don't spend money at those stores, you have zero points. It's going to be very hard to hit on Flex app for the Hyper Royals. I'm just telling the truth. I think I have like 200,000 points on lifetime points on Flex app, almost 300,000. And I just, I struggle to hit on Flex. I know people who have a million points on their account and they're always hitting on these releases. So the key with Flex is to make sure that you're spending money in store in order to get these points. And I think it's like, 100 points for every dollar you spend or something like that. So yes, the Hyper Rose will be on the app. Yes, there will be a good amount of pairs on there. 
you will be able to get pairs on there for retail. So you don't necessarily have to pay resale today as of the release date for the Hyper Rose. Now with JD and Finish Line, they, I don't know what they're going to do. They haven't decided yet. They could do their app raffle or they could do the in-store raffle. My personal preference, I love their in-store raffle just because it takes away everybody all over the country entering in random places. If you don't know, you can enter, like, let's say I'm in Texas and I want to enter in like Louisiana for the shoe or something like that. Like I could do that just because like some people can do that because they have bots or different things like that. But the in, with the in-store raffle, you can't do that. You, have to, you just go up to the store that's near you and enter. And it's really just location-based, uh, depending on what city you're in. So my preference will be the in-store raffle. I have hit at JD on the in-store raffles. And that's why I'm like, you know, that's the way to go. But you never know. We, we really don't know until they come up with information on what they're going to do. You know, it, it'll be interesting to see. But same with JD and Finish Line. They always get a good amount of pairs as well. So there will be chances there as well to get in-store, in-store retail pairs uh, from those locations as well. So there's, there doesn't have to be a rush today to pay resale for the, for the Hyper Royal ones. If you really want them, don't want to wait. You need them today. Go ahead and do it. You know, the, the price is, I, I want to say probably four or five, six hundred right now, resale prices right now for the Hyper Royals. You know, they, they, they are killing on the price, but as you see, Pairs are delayed. Some stores don't have shipments in. Resellers are going crazy. So it's really up to you if you want to spend that much money today to get the shoe. I know as shipments come in, the price will probably drop down some. I don't know what it'll get down to. I, I, I say maybe no less than 400. This, this, this pair is just like the university ones. As I said earlier, the mochas, it's, it's got the hype with it. So the price isn't going to drop crazy low it's not going to hit two hundred dollars at all it may not even hit three hundred dollars so like i said if you want to pay resale go ahead my recommendation would be to wait not pay resale yet just because stores will still have pairs coming in you will still have an opportunity to get pairs for resale so there's no need to rush or panic buy the shoe just because you didn't hit today you didn't hit on sneakers or you didn't hit at any of the other stores like shoe palettes that had pairs today or online, you know, online is crazy trying to get pairs online, especially with the foot sites online. So that would be my recommendation. Let me know in the comments if you were able to cop the Hyper Royal ones today on sneakers or on foot sites or wherever you shop at online that released the pairs today. Let me know if you're going to pay resale, if you're going to wait to see if uh, this the places wait till their shipments come in. I do know also that sneakers will do a huge restock like they have been doing over the past year, where they do like a Jordan Reserve or something like that on their app. Well, they have a bunch of recent pairs that came out and they'll put them on the app and allow you to purchase. So I know that will happen. I just don't know when it will happen, but it will happen this year. So you just have to give it a second, give it a minute and we'll find out later down the line. But let me know in the comments what you think. Did you cop? Are you paying resale? Are you going to wait? Let me know what you're going to do. If you have any information about stores in your area that will have pairs coming in late, put it in the comments just so we can help each other out. You know, we're all trying to show love and make sure everybody gets their size, gets their pairs, which is why I'm making this video, just so everybody can stay up to date on what's going on. But as always, like, comment, subscribe, turn on that notification bell, stay up to date, comment below your thoughts. I, I'm, I'm always active in the comments, so reach out to me. Follow me on Instagram. It's the same as the YouTube at Casper's Kicks. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Stay safe and stay blessed. And I'll catch y'all later.